Leko, also written as Leko, is a language isolate that, though long reported to be extinct, is spoken by 20 to 40 individuals in areas east of Lake Titicaca, Bolivia. The Leko ethnic population is about 80. Historical, social, and cultural aspects History Apart from some brief lists of vocabulary, the main document for which Leko is known is a Christian doctrine compiled by the missionary Andres Herrero at the beginning of the 19th century. That doctrine was published in 1905 by Lafon Quevedo, who used it as a source to make a grammatical description of the language. That work was virtually the only available document about Leko, until the linguist Simon van de Kerk located some speakers of the language and compiled some additional facts which enlarged the analysis of Quevedo. Use and description In Grimes 1988, Leko is classified as a language isolate and is considered extinct. However, Montaño Aragón 1987, found some speakers of the language in the region of Aden and in Apollo, La Paz, in France Tamayo Province in the Bolivian Department of La Paz, along Mapuri River in Laricaja Province situated also in the Department of La Paz. Some speakers were relocated by Van de Kerk 1994-97. These speakers, mostly men, were older than 50 years and had not habitually used the language since a long time before that. Van de Kerk relates that the speakers do not feel sufficiently secure to conduct a conversation spontaneously in Leko. Linguistic description Phonology In regard to the phonology of Leko, one can point out the following based on Van de Kerk, 2009-289-291. Leko has six vowel phonemes, a, e, i, o, u, and e. The opposition among the first five vowels is distinguished in the data, but the opposition between e, and, e, is found only in a limited number of words, as for example Pele, balsa, and Pele, name of plant. Lexicon and classes of words in regard to the lexicon and the classes of words in Leko, one can mention the following Van de Kerk, 2009-293-297 In Leko, four major categories of words are distinguished, noun, adjective, verb, and adverb. Besides, the language has a group of minor categories, names of people, personal pronouns, deictic pronouns, numerals, interrogative pronouns, etc. Nouns are characterized morphosyntactically by constituting the nucleus of a noun phrase and by allowing inflection of number and case. Some nouns or substantives in Leko are one. House. And foes. Daughter. In regard to the pronouns, Leko distinguishes four types, personal pronouns, such as era. I. I Y A. U. Singular. Kibi. He. She. Demonstrative pronouns, such as who, this, near the speaker, on, that, knew the addressee, and he know, that, far from the speaker and the addressee. Interrogative pronouns, such as ha, who, you, what, nora, where, and indefinite pronouns, expressed by means of dubitative phrases, composed of an interrogative pronoun and the suffixes as, also, and ka. Como. Leko has a large number of adjectival lexemes, which are characterized by expressing qualities of entities. Thus we have, for example, lois, bueno, suma, small. Leko has a decimal numeral system, composed of the following units, her, one, two, two, chai, three, durai, four, bircha. 5. Burfamo. 6. Toifamo. 7. Ch. Ifamo. 8. Bipila. 9. Inbariki. 10. The numbers 6 to 8 follow a system in base 5, as in Aymara, 6 equals 5 plus 1, etc. Leko has a limited number of adverbial lexemes, as, for example, come t. Late. Ch. 
Aka. Yesterday. China. Very. Single quote dot. Also, it has a group of post positions, which express location and which are combined easily with the case markers, such as Hecker. Afuera. Apor. Near. Has. Down. In regard to the verbs, these are characterized by functioning as the nucleus of the verbal phrase and by receiving inflectional suffixes of time and person, besides having a series of derivational suffixes. Apart from the auxiliaries neck and catch, leko has intransitive, transitive, and detransitive verbs. A typical characteristic of this language is that of giving much attention to the position of objects. It manifests itself, for example, in the following verbs, which always combine a noun expressing a position with the auxiliary catch. To be. Shell catch. To be laid halfway over an object. Lua catch. To be hanging. Chakak. To be sitting. Etc. Morphology In regard to the morphological characteristics of Leko, one can point out the following Van de Kerk, 2009 to 297 minus 313. Leko is a highly agglutinative language and it uses predominantly suffixes. In regard to morphology of nouns, nouns have inflection for number, by means of the pluralizing suffix aya, as in cho swai de aya, woman dim place, little women, and inflection for case, as for example the genitive moki, which is used with alienable entities like kuchi, paro, in yo moki kuchi, 1 sg gen, mi paro, the dative i ki, which indicates direction or goal, as in 1, the locative ra or te, which marks a locative complement or a directional locative, as in 2, the ablative rep bet, which indicates the locative e origin, as in 3, etc. Nouns can be combined, furthermore, with a set of derivative suffixes, as, for example, the diminutive de, which besides being combined with substantives, as in 1 de, house dim, little house, is combined also with adjectives, as is seen in 4. Another derivative suffix which affects nouns is the delimitative beka, which expresses the idea of no more, only, as is seen in 5. Leko has also deverbative derivative suffixes which derive nouns from verbs, as, for example, the infinitivizer sich in 6, which derives an infinitive form which functions as the subject of a sentence, and the agentive no, which form derived nouns which express an agentive, such as lamas no, work ag, worker. In regard to verbal morphology, verbs have inflection of person, which is formed by means of suffixes which mark the person of the subject and prefixes which mark the object, as is shown in 7, as is seen in figure 2. Besides inflection for person, the verb in leko can be combined with a series of inflectional suffixes which mark, for example, distinctions of aspectual temporal type. By way of example, 8 shows the use of the suffix of indirect knowledge, sid, mono, which is combined with the verb mock. Say from which it has been derived, in regard to the category of mood, in leko one uses suffixes like comma, power, bb, almost, among others, to indicate a possible event, as is seen in 9. Leko has, besides, two forms of imperative of the second person, one directed to only one person and another directed to various persons, as is seen in 10a, and 10b, verbs in leko can be combined, besides, with a set of derivational suffixes, related to aspect, as for example the completive high in, 11, to distinctions of movement, as, for example, the modifying suffix of movement wari in 12, and to valence, as for example the reciprocal suffix mo in 13, and the causative key in 14, in leko, one sees productive processes of reduplication. With substantives, reduplication can be interpreted as a heap, much of, with adjectives, a high degree of. With verbs the interpretation is very diverse and not always transparent, thus we have the reduplicate verb tiltil catch, to be undone, derived from tiltil, undone, which expresses a state or process, for which reason it is combined also with the auxiliary catch, to be. Speech In regard to the characteristics of spoken leko, one can point out the following As Van de Kerk 2009 to 315 points out, the order of the constituents is not fixed, although, in general, the subject takes the first position, especially if it involves a topicalized element. 
Besides, the object often precedes the verb, as is seen in 15. Leko is a pro-drop language. This means that an explicit pronominal subject is not required, although this can appear as in 16. Shara. We. In Leko, one sees simple and compound speech. Van de Kerk, 2009 to 316 minus 324. In regard to simple speech, diverse types are distinguished, such as, for example, existential spech, as 17, declarative speech, as 18, interrogative speech, be it confirmative, as 19a, or informative, as 19b, among others. In regard to compound speech, diverse types are also distinguished, juxtaposed speech, as 20, coordinate speech, as 21, and subordinate speech causal, concessive temporal, conditional, consecutive, as 22. References External links Diccionario Etnolinguístico y Guía Bibliográfica de los Pueblos Indígenas Sudamericanos, Leco Alan Fabre, 2005, in Spanish. Lenguas de Bolivia online edition provides information about a number of indigenous languages in Bolivia, such as Leco.